having a good quality connectivity is, is a key part of decision making now in farming. G'day, I'm Will McCarthy, a Chief Product Officer at Swarm Farm Robotics. Here at Swarm Farm, we build robotics for agriculture. The machine I have behind me is a 12 metre spraying robot. Our robot can interface with a whole heap of different attachments, they're not just a sprayer. So we call it SwarmBot and that's actually the, the vehicle, the autonomous platform. And then we have an API called Swarm Connect where we can interface and communicate with other attachments on board. Whether that's a sprayer, mower, slasher, spreader. So when we built SwarmBot we, we did design it to work 100% offline. In saying that, for a better user experience, uh, you know, having high quality connectivity to the machine is key. A machine might be operating at the back of your farm, it could be 200 kilometres from where you are in some, some cases for our farmers. You want to know what it's doing, you want to know it's operating, you want to know it's, it's still moving, it's still spraying, it's doing what you thought it was doing. If there is a fault, if it stops for something, if it runs out of chemical, runs out of fuel, as an operator you won't get a notification unless you have connectivity. So a big part of autonomy is the farmer being able to see what's going on in the field. And Swarmot does stream a lot of data back to um, an iOS app that we've developed. So every time we fire and we hit a weed, that data is captured and sent through to the iPad in real time so the farmer can see what their weed load is in their paddock, what they're doing, how much chemicals they're using per hectare, all that sort of information is there. And having, having a good quality connectivity is, is a key part of the decision making now in farming. Most of our machines currently operate on is in that 3G or 4G area. But there's some machines still operating at a commercial level now in, in farms that have very poor connectivity. And it might be one bar or two bars of 3G across the whole farm and that's it. And you might only get 50% of the farm with that coverage. What we're doing now, we're working with connected farms to trial Starlink technology on board the machine for a better connectivity and access to, to connectivity for our machines. For us, what we've found is the Starlink on the move technology has really revolutionised the way we're getting data and, and connectivity in the field. You've got a machine that's operating, and you know our machines do operate at low speed, so you know that 10 to 15 kilometres an hour. You know they've got you know 100, 150 megabits per second connectivity as they're operating and moving around the field. From an operational perspective for a farmer, that you know that's phenomenal. Farmers haven't seen connectivity like that ever in, in the agricultural industry. For us as a, as a business of Swarm Farm, it, it's also really exciting because you know if there's an issue with a, with a robot in a field, I can, we can see everything remotely. Uh, areas of poor connectivity, we can still see data, we can still get information off, but being able to grab data in real time, high bandwidth information, you know, that's really valuable. 